Hey guys, what's up? Today we're going to draw a location icon inside Adobe Illustrator. I'm Kent and this is Diagraphics. So the first thing we want to do is activate the grid and snap to grid. So go to view, then go to show grid, then go to view again and snap to grid. Then zoom in to the grid. And to make our snap to grid more accurate, we need to go to the transform panel. If it isn't open, you can find it in window and go down to transform. So with the transform panel open, Go to this drop down menu right here and uncheck align new objects to pixel grid. This will make everything snap more precisely to the grid. Now choose the ellipse tool and while holding down the shift key, draw a circle in one of these squares. Now choose the line tool and draw from the left side of the circle a long line. This long will be fine. Then go to the selection tool and select both elements. Then choose the rotate tool and while holding down the alt key to get these dots next to the cursor, click in the middle of the circle and rotate both elements by 60 degrees. Click OK. When the elements are rotated, go to the line tool again and draw a line from the right side of the circle and down until it crosses the other line. Now go to the selection tool again and select all the elements. Then choose the shape builder tool and click inside the circle and drag to fuse these two shapes. Then hold down the ALT key to subtract and delete these two shapes. So now the basic shape of the location icon is made, but we need the location icon to stand up straight. Therefore, we need to rotate it back again. So choose the rotate tool and while holding down the ALT key, click in the middle of the circle. So not down here, but in the middle of the circle. And because we want to counter rotate it, we need to type in minus to counter rotate and we need to counter rotate it half of the 60 degrees. So 30 degrees. Click OK. So now the shape is standing as we want it to. So if we zoom in a little bit more, we can see that this tip is very sharp. And if you want that, that's OK. But I like a more rounded look for my flat designs. We can achieve a rounded tip with a few simple steps. At first, simply make the stroke wider. Then go to the stroke menu and click round join. And as you can see, it is already more round. But if you want it a little bit more round, you can either increase the stroke width or you can click align stroke to outside. When you're happy with the shape of the tip, go to fill and give the fill a color. The color doesn't matter for now. Then go to object, go to expand appearance. Now go down to the pathfinder menu. And if it isn't open, once again, go to window and find it under pathfinder. Then go to the pathfinder menu and click unite. This unites everything into one single shape. From here, choose the ellipse tool and go to the middle of the circle. Remember it snaps so you don't have to be precise. Then hold down the ALT key and the SHIFT key and draw a shape that is going to be the hole in the location icon. Then go to the selection tool and select both elements. And because the circle is in front of the location icon, we will go down to the pathfinder menu and click minus front. Now you can simply give the location icon a color. If you want to watch more graphic design tutorials, you can click on one of the videos on the end card right now. Thank you for watching.